The Minsker meteorite is a fragment of an asteroid that landed here in the UK, in Gloucestershire, exactly a year ago. 28th of February, 2021, just before 10 p.m. The last meteorite to fall in the UK was 30 years ago, and this is the first meteorite that we've collected since. Yeah, so th there was a lot of excitement. This was a particularly pristine meteorite that we picked up incredibly quickly. It's also a relatively rare type of meteorite, so they're rich in lots of the key components for life. So by studying this type of meteorite, we can really start to say what kind of conditions had to be present in the early solar system for a planet to become habitable. So we were able to collect it quickly because of ground-based and satellite-based observations that were able to track the meteorite as it came in through the atmosphere. And from looking at that trajectory, we were able to predict exactly where it should have landed. Because of the really detailed trajectory, then we've got such a well-documented record of that, we can press rewind and see where it came from before it came to Earth, and it came from the outer edge of the asteroid belt. And we think that the parent asteroid of the Winchka meteorite formed about maybe three and a half million years after the solar system forms. So that's 4,563 million years ago. So we're able to get the clearest picture to date of what the early solar system was looking like. Yeah, so the, the meteor was picked up on a handful of, of citizen devices, so doorbell cameras, dash cams, and using all of those we were able to predict exactly where we should go and find the meteorite that we wouldn't have been able to find without that input from the general public. And then we were able to send a team of scientists out into the area. A really big piece of it fell onto a driveway of a family in, in Winchcombe, the Wilcox and they were absolutely fantastic. They picked it up using plastic bags within a few hours of hearing it land outside. They've even actually let us cut up their driveway and that piece of driveway is now in the Natural History Museum just to make sure we have as much sample as we physically can.